Hello everybody, my name is the Wolf Praise, and welcome back to another episode of Robocraft. In the last episode we built this giant craft here that is kind of awkward and has three legs. I'm not sure exactly what I had in mind, but yeah, I, I built a thing, and today we're going to test it out. I know it's been a little while since the last episode of Robocraft, so if you guys would like to see some more, just make sure to leave a like down below and I'll definitely bring you guys some more. Uh, but today, let's go and get into a battle and uh, see what we can do. Now, do you see that they have this new mode down here, which is the Brawl? I guess it's supposed to be a mode that was brought back, so yeah, I guess we'll go ahead and try this out today. This is a game mode featuring twists on rules, weapons, and movement types. Sure, well, let's go. Game rules, elimination mode, no auto healing. The robot must be between 250 and 1250 CPU, and 10 team size. Okay, we finally found the match over here. I've never actually played this mode before, so I'm not sure exactly what to expect. I think it's pretty much just like a team deathmatch, but with 10 people on each team, so it should be pretty hectic and pretty fun. But I do know there's actually different robots in the factory, but I don't know how to, like, actually edit them. So if you guys know how to do that, make sure to leave it down below in the comments, because, yeah, I don't know how to do that, and I, I wouldn't be able to build a robot myself, because I don't think I'm that skilled, but... Yeah, if, if there is some kind of way to actually edit those robots, let me know. Thank you. So it's down at the bottom, there's no respawn and elimination. Oh, I'm not sure how I feel about that. I'll kill them all to win, eliminate the enemy team, capture the base, alternatively, capture the enemy base. Alright, well I do know that we at least have a couple of the nano binders on the side so that we can heal our team. So hopefully that will work out. I'm just going to try to stay with the majority of people and hope that we don't die. Now this thing isn't actually able to fly, but you can't hover for quite some distance, so I don't know if that will be useful for us, but yet yeah, at the very least, I, I have some cool stuff on this thing. Let's go and try to take these guys out from a distance if we can. Also, the flying aircraft, try to get those out of here as quickly as possible, because they do a lot of damage from up high and they're really hard to hit. This guy up here, already taken out, beautiful. Now I see a couple of people over there in the distance, but I don't actually see them, I just see their name tags, so it's kind of scary. I'm just staying with our team for right now, let's go and heal some people up if we can. There we go, just heal up all of our team. I mean, right off the bat, it seems like we're doing better than they are because most of our team is healing each other, and I haven't seen any of their team do that. Oh crap, this guy though, he's starting to hurt me. Let's go and just try to take cover, shoot him as much as we can. Hopefully one of our teammates will try to come back and heal me. Okay, I am going to step back though. Sorry, I'm scrambling a little bit, I'm just not used to this mode. A little bit scared, you guys know how it is. I could always just play as like a support player and just heal all of our team, so I think I may try to do that for most of it. And then once I do actually see someone, I feel like I'll be able to hit them. I will go ahead and do that. Yeah, I think for the time being, it's just better to heal up all of our team. This guy going back. I got you, buddy. Don't even worry about it. Oh, they're going back and capturing our point. Heal this guy as we're going back. This guy's already taken out. Beautiful. Go ahead and heal him back up. Uh, the flying guy, he seems fine. Nice. Uh, this guy over here, though, he's not doing too good. Let's go ahead and heal him up. There you go, buddy. I'm a nice teammate. Look at me. I'm helping you. Looks like they have two people taken out, and we also have two people taken out. So it's pretty even so far. I see this guy up here in the air. Let's go and try to shoot him a little bit. I've done some damage. He landed up there. I'm not sure what that's all about. Oh, crap. Uh, oh, yep, but this is not good. Okay, I'm gonna go back, try to heal this guy. Alright, uh, yeah, I'm not sure how to feel about this. We've lost two, or three people now, and they still have two people down. No, nope, now it's three. Good. I think we can actually heal from behind cover as well. I'm not entirely sure, but it does say it's locked on, so I don't actually have to aim at him. That's pretty good. For the time being, I'm just gonna focus on healing this guy until he dies, and then once he does die, we will go ahead and try to attack the, ten uh, the enemies. Yeah, I'm not sure exactly what's going on yet, but I think... I think we're doing okay. Looks like both of the teams have lost four people now, so that's not too good. This guy over here, getting damaged again. Why are you running out there, dude? You probably shouldn't be doing that. Oh crap, this guy's about to die. I really don't want that to happen. Okay, yep, that, that happened. Okay, uh, now it's a flying guy. I don't like the flying guys. This guy, yeah, get back over here behind cover, dude. What are you doing? A lot of our team is damaged, so I'm just trying to heal them up as they are hopefully attacking the enemies. Looks like both of us are down to four people each, so, so far, still even. Trying to heal this flying guy here so he can go out and do some good stuff for the team. Whoop, I don't know what just happened there, but I did some kind of flip. Okay, that guy's taken out. That's no good. Yeah, um, I'm starting to get a little bit scared about this. Oh crap, yep, here they come. Okay, I'm just gonna try to take this guy out quickly. Try to take out the weapon so he can't be da doing too much damage to us. He's about to die. There we go, come on now. Get wrecked, dude. There we go, okay, beautiful. Now heal up our team again. Oh, the wrong button. Oh, where, where's that button? Oh, they've actually knocked off those uh, healing things. I'm actually gonna try to get the healing from this guy so that I can do some healing as well. So yeah, I'm sorry teammate for stealing the healing from you, but it's for the greater good. Wait, does he have healing things as well? I don't think so. I think he's just like a damage robot. Come on, give me the healing. Oh gosh, okay. Uh, I don't know where the people are. Oh, they're right there. Holy crap. Okay, do some damage to his weapons. Get them out of there. Yeah, I don't think he can do any more damage, so I'm just gonna go ahead and go walk up on him and take him out real quick. Whoop. Oh, where is he? Apparently he's still there. Um, hacker? Glitch? Not sure. Apparently they only have two people left and we have three, so, so far so good. Just gonna try to heal these people up since we do have our healing things back again. Okay, I'm also gonna heal this guy that has been, been healing us because, of course, you know, I gotta repay the favor. Just sitting here healing each other. Nice little bond going on. I appreciate that. Okay, whoop. I guess they're attacking the objective. Uh, where is that even supposed to be? I think it's all the way over there. Uh, or, or, oh no, I think we're actually cap uh, capturing theirs. 
I'm not entirely sure, but that, that's what I'm going to go for. Running backwards and healing this guy. I'm not sure what's going on. I think we are capturing their point, or they're capturing ours. Either one of those things, it's... I'm not, I'm not sure, but let's go capture theirs real quick. We're capturing the point. Three people on this point. Uh, one person over on our point, so I think that means we should win. At least, you know, logically. He's doing some kind of crouch dance, so I'm going to join him. Because, of course, you got to crouch dance. There we are. I think we're pretty much healed up, so I'm just going to stand here and accept the win, I hope. Oh, I see some down in the chat. They're saying we are a legend and GG, all kinds of good stuff like that. You know, I love this team. They seem like really nice people. They healed me up. I healed them up. It was a nice little mutual relationship we had there. Looks like I did some good healing for the team. Not too good of damage, but I don't think I really had that great of weapons. Uh, the score was, I think, like third place for the team. So, yeah, I mean, third place, not bad. I'll take it. I think we did level up as well, so that's pretty cool. Uh, now what happens? Oh, I thought they got rid of the crates. Maybe they, like, reversed that update because I really did not like that update. I just feel like the crates are, you know, a little bit more fun to open up and all that great stuff. So, if you guys didn't know, leave a like down below because it increases the chances of goodness, I guess. Anyway, let's go and open this up. See what we get here. Uh, looks like some armor bits. Uh, some more long rods. You gotta have those. Uh, plasma bombarder. That seems pretty useful. And another front laser wasp, which I actually have a whole bunch of those, so... Not really that useful, but I'll take it. Also, I have another Protonium crate over here, so let's go and open this one as well. See if we get anything a little bit better. Oh, Epic Part. Nice. All right. Pretty much any Epic Parts are going to be better than Rare Parts. Uh, that is a Strut Arc that connects two cubes together. I've never actually seen one of those before, so I guess that'll be useful? Question mark? Sure, collect items. Thank you. Oh, we also got a diamond box as a result of our position in the leaderboard of the end of the last match. I think that's what it pretty much says at the top there. Uh, paraphrasing, of course. Let's go and see what we get in this bad boy. Uh, looks like a leg. Giant mech leg. Cool. And a rudder hawk. Nice. And again, there's still one more of the protonium crates. Let's go and open this bad boy. Give me some better parts. You know you want to. Uh, light edge and a uh, front laser blaster. I think the light edges are actually better than most of, the, uh, most of the other, like, little edge parts, so we'll go ahead and replace those. And I thought the last one was going to be the last one, but no, I, I guess it might be this one. Alright, just, just give me some good parts, you know you want to. Okay, again with the green parts, I don't know, like, what the rarities are, but I think the green is, like, common, the blue is supposed to be rare, and the, uh, little purple doodads are supposed to be epic. Not entirely sure, but that's what I think anyway. I never claimed to be an expert at this game, man. I, I just play for the fun, and that, that's all that matters to me. Well, let's go and throw in a couple of more of these health parts since we did get those. Like these strut arcs over here actually have 16,000 health per piece, so yeah, that, that's pretty dang good. I'm not sure where we'd be able to attach those though. Oh, we could pretty much just attach them anywhere. Uh, so let's go and actually, whoop, not, oh, wrong button. Uh, let's actually mirror those just so it is symmetrical, and we'll go ahead and just put those right there for now. Sure, why not? We also have these light edges. Let's go ahead and find some places to put these. Uh, let's go ahead and just rotate those up, and we'll just go ahead and put them, like, across the whole bottom here. There we are, beautiful. And I think we can also do it, like, the other direction as well. Yep, or, actually, that looks weird. I, I kind of wanted to, like, kind of lay flush with these other ones, but I don't think that's a possibility. We'll just go ahead and put them like this, then. There we go, put those all the way across. It, oh, not like that. Oh, crap, how do I delete? I always forget. Okay, it's just right-click. Okay, I put the other one right in the middle. Okay, there we are. I just put those struts at the bottom so that they can't actually be blown off too easily. That's my hope anyway. They would have to shoot through, like, my legs to be able to hit them. And, yeah, hopefully that'll mean we keep the health. I'm not sure how the game works, but, yeah, something like that. Sounds logical to me. We also have these long rods that we could slap on somewhere. Can we actually get those, like, lay flat across or like this? I don't think so. Unless we, like, attach it this way, which it doesn't seem to want to do. Oh, we can kind of do it like that. Sure, why not? Plus, we could always just move those later on to be able to put more weapons off to the side like I did with these nano boosters here. So, yeah, I just went ahead and slapped them on for the health boost. Now, looking at the base health, I don't think it increased too much, but the health boost definitely did because I know that it wasn't higher than the base health before, like, at least by the bar standard, so... Yeah, like I said, I, I don't know how I'm playing this game. I'm just I'm just playing it for fun. So, you know, I I'm having fun. That means I'm succeeding. Yeah, I think that will be it for today's video of RoboCraft, guys. I hope you all did enjoy. If you did, make sure to leave a like down below and subscribe to join the pack because we're pretty dang cool around here. If you guys ask me, if you'd like to see more episodes of this game, just make sure to leave a like down below, maybe a comment telling me so. And uh, yeah, I'll try to bring it, bring it a little bit more often. That's what I was trying to say there, but I, I can't speak sometimes. Of course, there'll be a couple of my other videos from early in the week up here at the end screen, as well as in the card icon up in the top right. Definitely go watch some of those. I make a video every single day all throughout the week. And of course, other than that, thank you guys so much for watching and liking. I hope you have a great day, follow your dreams, and I will see you guys in the next one. Take care, and stay awesome, guys.